366 Days with Wisdom by Venerable Master Xingyun. April 6. Be an upright person who dares to speak and act. Do not be a passive good person who is muddled and confused. What are the qualities of a so-called good people? Let us define these qualities. 1. Compassionate people are good people. One should not be indiscriminately compassionate to the point of even concealing and sheltering criminals. On the contrary, this would be a cruel act and injustice to societies. A compassionate person should have compassion with wisdom and courage. 2. Diligent people are good people. One should not be excessively indulged in enjoyment, often making mischief and creating problems for others. Diligence should be centered on right effort to serve others, earnest practice, cultivation, and the readiness to take up kajal for a just cause. This is one of the criteria of a good person. 3. Courageous people are good people. One should not be crude or crass, reckless or ruthless, or flaunt one's superiority, or use violence to seek enjoyment, or use blunt strength to bully the weak. All these are not qualities of a good person. Courageous people must have benevolence, loyalty, and the ability to shoulder consequences. They must be sincere and seek progress. These are the characteristics of a good person. 4. Sensible people are good people. One should not be argumentative or an armchair critic who is only good at putting forth argument but has accomplished nothing. How can such a person be considered good? A sensible person accepts good advice, readily helps and support others. Sensible means setting discipline for oneself and being accommodative and tolerant. This is the key to being a sensible person. Read, reflect, and act. A compassionate person should have compassion with wisdom and courage. Please tune in same time tomorrow as we meet on air.